Hi, my name is Christopher Sutton. I'm a lead family attorney at our at Robinson and Henry. And it comes up very often with our clients uh, in our uh, the current pandemic we're dealing with. How is COVID going to impact my parenting time? If my spouse comes down with COVID or a member of the household my spouse is living in comes down with a positive COVID uh, diagnosis. The reality is that that may be a basis to withhold parenting time depending on your circumstances. People often ask us about emergency motions to restrict parenting time. The important thing to know about an emergency motion to restrict parenting time is that the court is going to want to know, are the children in imminent uh, danger of either physical or emotional harm? The per first part of that is there is there an imminent danger? So is your spouse saying I have COVID or a member of my household? Do they have I they have COVID as well, but I still want to exercise parenting time with my children. That means that there's an imminent risk to the children. If your spouse is saying that they're willing to wait until they're they're better or their uh, household member is, is feeling better. Uh, and they're willing to follow the requisite guidelines put out by the CDC, then you don't have an imminent risk to the children because they're waiting for um, their household to be free of COVID before parenting time resumes. But if they're insisting on parenting time occurring, you may have a basis to file an emergency motion to restrict because they're putting the children in harm's way. That is something that we would want to flush out with you in a consultation. Um, if that is the, you're experiencing these sort of circumstances, please contact the office. We give free consultations and we're looking forward to your call.